And this was extracted. Oh, had, had any of us seen McCombie before this fight? Like, before the press conference? <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, bro, I have respect for this dude. I respect. This was a hey. dope fight. I respect this dude. I didn't Favorite know how much of the night. Dope. Dope. A great he's fight. Got, great fight. He's got serious puncher power. Like, that power. Man. When he hit him with the body. Okay, I don't want to get into it, but like that body, I was like, okay. Never no, seen let's get into it. Like, you know, we, we set up the clip. I mean, like, that dude, that dude is dangerous. <laughs> let, let, let's see what uh this is hand selected from uh Caleb Plant's Instagram, so it's gonna be a little biased. He's gonna show you the last minutes when he had him on the ropes, but let's go into it. Let's, let's, left hook to the body, left uppercut, right hook. A beautiful combination, Joe by Plant. And, and Plant's so smart, he gets under that counter hook every time. He's not gonna be waiting to fight. Ooh, ooh, he's working. Big punch. Oh, but again. That's all she wrote. Man. I finished right there, man. So we gave we gave Caleb Mab props in previous episodes. In his um, let's point out the fact that he he had a change in trainers. Mm. Did y'all peep that? No. Breadman, he got Breadman in the corner now. Word, I didn't know that. And did you notice his whole uh, theme is revenge tour? Yo, I like Cle- I, I like Caleb, man. I like Caleb. Um, he, he, he had a had a, he smart fought, fought a smart fight. He had to make an adjustment, yeah. like pushing. He, uh, at one point, I can't remember what, what round, but to push him on the ropes. And uh, after he was hurt, he got hurt without a hook. He really mm-hmm. would should have been a knockdown. He immediately mm-hmm. goes to push him, or coming back on his back foot, putting him on the ropes. And was just touching him and getting his hands loose and letting him go. Then he got to a really good rhythm. Um, I really that I, I I was really I was going for plant. Was a little concerned seeing him make an adjustment. And man, it's electric fight. I've actually become a fan of McCumby as well. McCumbie, you know, yeah. just right there. Yeah, he got some got some dog. What was that? Well. Let's talk about. He threw a, a left hook that landed on Caleb's right shoulder. And triggered a, a knockdown at that moment. I was like, oh, oh yeah! I like, oh, I, I, I thought he something. was just running in there. Yeah, he was running in there like his whole body weight was behind his punches. Mm-hmm. I'm like, he he <laughs> he is not. He didn't come here to play. Dang. You know that. Dang. He did not Dang. come here to play. But hey, it was no. Nah, that was that was a really great fight, man. That was electric. It was fun. It was entertaining. It was competitive. Like everything you want. So this is what I'll say. <laughs> The performance that McCumby put on will land him on more undercards. Absolutely. That is the that is the type of performance that Berlanga should have looked to deliver. Even if you put yourself out there to get caught, you establish yourself as an exciting fighter, which right. up until this point, like people believe Berlanga to be an exciting fighter because of the the results that he got. But you know, mm-hmm. here's McCumby. Had his opportunity in the big bright lights, and he went broke. Right, right. Yeah, it was entertaining. I love, I love the the, uh, the shit talking and the back and forth and like the go to and all that in the ring. You know, I'm, I'm with that. It's just, it's just part of the sport. It's fun at the end of the day. It's entertainment. So an adjustment, there, like an adjustment. That too. Like, Caleb had yeah. to adjust. Real life, like real time adjustments were crazy. Caleb a, is a lot of there's a lot of Caleb tools is, in that belt. You know, I, I knew Caleb for being a good IQ fighter, and that's what I credit him. And then I watched him closely throughout this fight, and Caleb got good feet. Caleb has good mm-hmm. level change. Caleb has crazy combination after combination after. I'm like, oh, yo, mm-hmm. Caleb is really, really the truth. He's not just a tough, you know stubborn you can't get me out of here type of dude you know hey fight me hey you know that type of dude because that's like that's the that's caleb we thought you know um, that's that's what i thought in the past like he's, he's hard to put away he's stubborn he he always has a vim to him because he's always beefing with his fight whoever's gonna fight with there's gonna be static he um he's just tough and very smart very good even cano said very smart fighter 
But that footwork was ridiculous. The way he was just setting him up with the level changes. I'm like, oh my gosh. And then, you, you, like you said, Kevin, uh, Trevor McCombe, right? He's level of adjusting and just the way the power was just straight. I was hearing those shots on the TV like, wow. I was like, yo, that, that yeah. stuff sounds loud yeah. over there. Like, oh, man. this dude is <laughs> hell. And he just ran out of gas. It was a beautiful fight. Beautiful yeah. fight. Uh, salute to both fighters. Caleb, Caleb finally found himself on the on the other end of that. Because usually it's Caleb playing, waning in those seven seven plus rounds in the championship round. And the mm-hmm. only reason I bring up Berlanga is because I don't even see him as a worthy opponent for Caleb Plant. You know what I mean? Like, mm. I, you know, like as far as mm. performance wise, like it's probably fights. If, if, you know, it, it's probably that likely to get made. But I, I get what you're saying. It's like yeah. Caleb Plant has a uh, rose to the occasion. You know, even in defeat, you know, boxing fans are like, you know, we all have a high respect for Caleb Plant because we know he he out there. He's he gonna nice. put it online every time, nice. every time. So they can, mm-hmm. fight. you know what? Maybe he can uh, go fight uh, Pacheco. You know, Belay can fight Pacheco. You can have another Mexico versus Puerto Rico <laughs> type. You know, it's ceremonial, <laughs> it's ceremonial about. But I love it. You know, get a get a bag know. real quick. Have it on Labor Day weekend. That'll be fire. Don't don't give him no ideas, man. <laughs> Come on. Free, All free. Right. 